The CS2 devs do not want the jump throw bind from CSGO to be a part of CS2. This is a huge talking point and issue right now among the pro scene as well as competitive. Now, this wouldn't be an issue at all if the regular jump throw for CS2 the manual way worked fine and was consistent, which is not. Up until this point, the only way to do a jump throw bind consisted of like two to three buttons compared to the one button in CSGO or you could also program it through your keyboard. Some of my Discord members came up with a new jump throw bind that works like CSGO where it's one button, so let's get right into it. Shout out to Mean who showed off the original version here, and we're going to see the updated version when we scroll down in my Discord. The one I'll be showing in the video here is the one shown from Kazakh. Thank you to both, and make sure to join my Discord so you don't miss out on early access content like this. Before I show you the rest, here's a quick word from my sponsor. Skins Monkey, a site where you can trade your old skins and get new ones. Pick out all the ugly and old skins you don't want. Then you're going to pick out something nice and you're essentially upgrading your skins. Get a free $5 on your trade using code NART. You can also buy skins using code NART. You'll get a 35% bonus. Use the link below in the description to get your new skins. First, you're going to go into the description of this video and you're going to copy the bind that I listed. Once you have it copied, open up a notepad and paste it in there. Afterwards, save it whatever you want. I called it binds, but you could put it in your auto exec, your config. So I save it as binds.cfg. After you do this, you're going to want to put it in the right folder. So you're going to go to your local C program files, x86, Steam, Steam apps, common, Counter-Strike Global Offensive, game, CSGO, CFG. Once you have that done, let's boot up CS2. All right, once you're in the game, open console, type in exec, and then whatever you named that config. So I named it binds. And it says here, exec and binds. And so let's go into a private server now, or offline server. And let's test it out. All right, so let's see if this works. Okay. That's me jumping with my jump throw, and here is me with my forward run throw. Now let's test out some smokes, shall we? Now I'm gonna use the jump throw bind to throw top con smoke, stand in this corner, aim here, and I'm gonna press the bind, which is V, then left click at the same time. It works perfectly like how it would in CSGO. This only requires one button. To show you that the run throw bind works, I'm gonna throw the top con smoke that uses it. So I'm gonna stand there, aim here, then I'm going to press my bind, which is H, and then left click at the same time. And here we go. It lands perfectly. Guys, this might get patched. So if it does not work anymore, I am going to show you guys a new way to do so by showing you how to do it from the keyboard. So make sure to subscribe and I will be looking out to see if this is patched or not.